Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video about the beautiful Volkswagen GTI. Today's video is going to be the opposite of my last video, which was five things I definitely do not like about the Volkswagen GTI. Today is going to be five things I definitely do love about the Volkswagen GTI, and I think you guys all agree with me. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and let's get to it. How easy it is to add a really good amount of power very quickly and very cheap. I know it's not cheap for some of you guys, but for like a thousand bucks to get an, close to another 100 horsepower, seriously, is doable. Especially if you're buying all used, you know, used intercooler. Tune, you can't really get away with used. I wouldn't. Tunes usually run 600 bucks, so you can't get away from that. That's a big boy. You can get an air intake, 180. You can get a downpipe, 200. You're right there, you're about a thousand bucks for close to another extra 100 horsepower. And then, Secondly, what I truly love about the Volkswagen GTI over any other car is how easy the battery is to be accessed. If you need a jump like me, my car's been sitting here for a while, so she's dead. If you don't know already, the bag down here is kaput, and I had to get a new one, luckily warranty. So we're gonna get her put in very, very, very shortly, so we'll be back on the road, but you know how it is. Number two is definitely the battery. I love it. I know it seems odd for you guys to know that, but I've been through a lot of cars, I've jumped a lot of people's cars, and I found out it's just so easy, just boom, boom. These and trucks, most European cars, they, I honestly have an issue with them because they stuff them under the little firewall right here, like this one will be like over there, and then they'll have like a little clamp, something like this. Or they put them in the back of the trunk where, all, where you put all your stuff. You know how you fill it up, and the next one is definitely going to be on how easy it is to access everything for an oil change. You can get an oil change done, easy 10 minutes, jack her up, pull the plug out, let it drain, wrench out the oil filter right here, pull it out, put it in, 10 minutes, done. I know a lot of the oil filters on other cars, they put them in weird spots. They put them like down here sometimes or up under the car, so you have to get under there and do it and like, ah. You already have a hard time doing the oil plug, so why not add another one? Not on the GTI, because it's right here, you just pop her off, put her on. The next thing I truly love about the Volkswagen GTI, and I don't know if really anyone truly cares about this, but I do personally, the dashboard on these, I think it's called fax leather, so it's like, it's like fake, but not. It's kind of like cheap leather. From experience, I've never seen it go bad. Never dry rot from any sun or anything like that. On a lot of other cars, you're gonna have like literal plastic and it's just, it's not good. Not bad at all. I truly love the dash so much. I know it's such an odd thing to think about. Boom, for the next thing about the Volkswagen GTI is gonna be the amount of storage space you can have in it. I know right here, from here, back are supposed to be chairs. So kind of from like, yeah, so from right here down is gonna be your storage space in the back, which is really good, standard, but we, as hatchbacks, have a plus because you can put the seats down and have this much space, so you can put, uh, I don't know, possibilities are endless. Uh, for me, I put lawnmowers, I put dogs, I've moved half my house here, I've put vacuum cleaners, a snow blower, tons of fishing pole, tons of fishing stuff, Perfect for drive-through movies. Make yourself a little bed with you and your fun one. Boom, Volkswagen GTI. That is why I love it so much. So that was a really short video of what I what I really love about the Volkswagen GTI. That's my personal opinion. I wanna hear what you guys think is really awesome for the Volkswagen GTI. And see, tell me what you use it for and what is like the best feature for you. If you guys love the video, please do leave a like. Make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys on the next video, which is hopefully fixing my airbag if it can get here fast enough. See you guys later.